Hello YouTube, if you are a OnePlus 2 user, I think this is high time for you to know about routing and custom ROMs because we already know that OnePlus announced that they won't be releasing any new update for the OnePlus 2 Oxygen OS. So in this video, I will show you how you can install custom ROMs on your OnePlus 2 in a step by step, simple to follow. So first of all, you need, should know about the XDR developers, this is a forum. And I will provide a link in the description. So you need to come here and type for the OnePlus 2. Uh, type your device as OnePlus 2. So you will show the OnePlus 2 here. And this is the OnePlus 2 page will look like. Here there are two sections you need to check. If you scroll down below, you can find OnePlus 2 Android development and OnePlus 2 original Android development. So these are the two sections you can find a lot of ROMs inside. So for example, I will go with this Android to Android development OnePlus 2. So this is the page will look like and you can see a lot of threads post here. If you look closely, you can find ROM in front of some of the posts like this is a ROM, this is a ROM, this is a ROM. If you keep on looking, there are like many ROMs are there and then you can find kernels. These are the custom kernels. So this is how the post will look like for the uh, custom ROMs. So in this video, for an example, I will show you how you can install a, a ROM, a, one of the most famous ROM, which is Lineage OS ROM. So I'll go ahead and uh, open that page. So this is the page will look like. Again, you can see the uh, this is a ROM, and which is based on Android version 7.1.2. This is an official build; that's not a problem. And this is the uh, build date. And you can find the descriptions about that ROM down below, and you can also find the download links and OpenG apps. Uh, things like that and uh, each and every uh, ROM page might look like different so this is the lineage OS ROM so if you are taking another ROM which is a uh, famous ROM which is called resurrection remix unofficial so you can also look at the t uh, title you can see this is a ROM for your OnePlus 2 this is an official build uh, this is the version and this is Android version 7.1.2 like that and if you look closely you can find a lot of description about this ROM so some developers will be uh, talking more about the ROM features and all so you can find main features and all you can you can see a lot of features with this ROM and if you scroll down you can you might also find the installation instruction for specific ROMs like how you can install this one like you need to download latest build download G apps and then take an Android backup and then you know, wipe full flash ROM using the TWIP recovery flash G apps like something like that and then if you are just updating the ROM, current ROM, then it'll be this that'll be a different steps. Like we don't need to do this full wipe factory reset like you did for the fresh installation. So these are the simple steps you can follow. You make sure you always read these uh, instructions before routing or installing this new ROM. So further ado, I will go and show how you can install the custom ROM. So uh, in this video, I'll be showing how you can install the Lineage OS. And this is the link and I will provide all the link in the description. So first of all, OnePlus 2 bootloader must be unlocked before installing any custom ROMs. So I have already made a video regarding this. So I will provide that link also in the video description. And this is the uh, video that I've made, which will show you how to uh, root, unlock bootloader and install TWRP on your OnePlus 2. So just go ahead and Unlock your bootloader and install TWRP and then you can install the custom ROMs. So, so first of all, go ahead and unlock your bootloader and install TWRP. So uh, then we'll go and download the Lineage OS ROM because we are taking the Lineage, Lineage OS here. So here is the download section. Go ahead and uh, download it from the download link and you need to install G apps as well. G apps will contain Google Play Store and other Google applications that you required. So here uh, you can see the Lineage OS ROM page and you can look for the latest version so you can find that down below. So download this latest version as well as you need to download the OpenG apps. So this is the OpenG apps link and you need to select the platform as ARM64 so this is the CPU architecture of OnePlus 2 and then because we are installing the 7.1.2 based custom ROM that's mentioned in the title here. If you are installing any other build like a Marshmallow based ROM or 7.0 based ROM, you need to select 
particular this one uh, Android selection. So here I'm as we are installing 7.1.2 based ROM, I'll select uh, 7.1, and then in the variant you can say, see a lot of variants. It's better you go for the minimum one, like a nano, so it will be having the Google Play Store and very limited number of Google apps. So once you selected these three options, click uh, click here, so it will download these files. Here you can see I've downloaded both the Lineage OS ROM file as well as the OpenG apps. Now I'm going to copy these files to OnePlus 2. So here you can see I've uh, downloaded those files here into my OnePlus 2 inside the lineage voice and this is the lineage voice file and the G apps now I'm going to uh, restart my phone to recovery mode so first I will power off this device now uh, I need to press volume down and power button at the same time press and hold them I need to press the volume down so it will load to the TWRP recovery. So this is TWRP recovery. We have some functions here like uh, uh, you can install. You can uh, first of all, what you need to do is you need to take a backup of the current ROM. So in case something goes wrong, you can restart it later. Then you need to go to wipe, and then you need to do a factory reset wipe. Once that is done, go back to the main screen again, and then. There's a install option, so click on install and then browse the downloaded lineage file. So I put it into the download lineage folder, so I'm moving to there and first select the ROM file that's the lineage ROM file. I'll select it and then swipe to flash. Once the ROM is flashed, go back to the main screen again and then click on install again. Because we need to flash the G apps, Google Apps, we select G apps, and then swipe to flash that also. Some ROMs might come with uh, G apps pre-installed. In that case, you don't need to do this. And it might take some time, so please be patient. All the flashing is done. Now we're going to reboot the system. Click on reboot, and you don't need to install this. So the phone will reboot to the newly installed ROM and the first uh, boot might take some time so you have to be patient as you can see here it is showing the boot logo for the first time okay here you can see the ROM is loaded so I'll go ahead and uh, um, finish this initial setup I'm going to skip all these uh, settings for now so once the uh, first initial setup is done you can see the ROM is loaded finally so it's running like as smooth as intended and you can all check out the about phone and then check out the ROM versions and uh, the Android versions and everything. So this is how you can install any custom ROM on your OnePlus 2. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more.